you did. Nice. All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the final episode of What Commandments Are There in the TAD Tournament Mod. Today, I'll be showing you both OKW and UKF. We're starting off with the OKW faction. And Commander number one, we got the 18th Artillery Division. And it has access to a whole bunch of stuff. First of all, your leagues, if you might build them, can use incendiary rounds. Second off, you can get some spotting infantry for your leagues or any other form of artillery you might need. This is the Jäger Light Infantry Recon Squad, of course. It's coming in at 3 CP, so a little bit delayed compared to the vanilla. Then we got the Infiltration Tactics, a very good grenade assault. Last, no, this is not even last yet. We, of course, have a big fair artillery piece in this doctrine as well. All the artillery commanders have one, and here it is at the left edge. And last, but definitely not least, is the assault artillery. Of course, barrage is a target zone, followed by a smoke screen. So, that is commander number one of the artillery division. Quick restart. Well, then we'll get into commander number two. And commander number two will be the Tiger Group. And in this Tiger Group, we got a nice passive here the ability to build a Goliath. Might show us a couple good memes in the game. And every uh, armed doctrine, of course, has a scouting ability. And the scouting ability in the OKW one will be the smoke bomb. So. This is scouting, but also can be used as some defensive smoke, which can be very nice. Now, to support and oversee all your beautiful tanks, we got a nice, beautiful Sturm Officer to come and support your troops. As the artillery barrage in this doctrine, we got the off map rocket barrage. Quite devastating with the 280mm rockets. 200 munitions comes quite early as well, so it might be very useful. And last but not least, we got the Tiger Panzer Kampfwagen Sex, of course, coming in at the 11 CPs. This thing can tear any Allied tank apart, as long as it doesn't get shot itself too much, of course. So that's it for the Tiger Group Commander. We've got one more KW Commander to show you. Armand, 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 always in dirty mind. And after this, I'll show you guys the UKF commanders, which are quite fun as well. Press a key. And the last one here is the Luftwaffe. Squadron, it has the field defenses, the Stuka smoke reconnaissance, Fallishimegas at 4 CP, some elite infantry to help support. And then, as a buildable, we got the Flak Panzer 4 Ostwind, which can be a nice unit if you rush it out. Uh, can cause some uh, surprise amongst the allied ranks, but can also help against shooting down allied planes and stuff like that. So, my very first store unit. Um, and last but not least, the 105mm Howitzer Barrage. I just need to check one thing because I think something wasn't working in here. And it probably is still being worked upon by our mother. Yeah, this ability is currently not working. I hope my model will get to it before tomorrow. 
and he should. Otherwise, he won't get paid. Scam. <laughs> Oh, and then we got a V. Hey, okay, yeah, for the British army. Which also got three of their own commanders, so let's uh, check them out real quick. Bada bim bada boom and load it. Alright, the first commander once again the infantry slash artillery commander yeah, for the Brits is the British strike squadron. Uh, it's packing some hot gear with access to the M2 flamethrower. So where your engineers can be upgraded with the flamethrower. Then we got 280 no key. That's interesting. Is this even working? Oh shit. Am I finding another park here? Do -do 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 -do. An infantry section of Tommy's ah, has been trained. The no key, of course, is the assault infantry section. Available to you at two CPs. It's working just fine. Then we got M5 half track support, which you can uh, use to make some party bus with flamethrowers or maybe assault uh, sections, or you can upgrade it with the beautiful anti air package, also known as the meat chopper, the kraut grinder, the 450 car machine guns, very good against 52s as well, if I might just say that. Uh, a couple of CPs later, you of course got the British artillery priest. Special units on Saxton, way. probably the best name in the game, of course. And last but not least, once you have a platoon command post, a platoon command post is coming as requested. Let me speed this up. Instant production. A new platoon command post is ready. Oh, that's a lie. It isn't ready. Now it's ready. You have all that beautiful concentration for us. Quite cheap, but we'll come in a little bit later than it gets in, in normal in games. They got beautiful artillery from the Brits, supported by some nice infantry. Now, for commander number two, we of course have a commander themed around tanks. We also have a commander themed around air force. So let's see, who are we going to see first here? Three, two, one. Click the key, and we'll first see the 79th Armored Division. It has a whole bunch of abilities. The first ability will be the Designate Command Vehicle. Gives a couple of auto buffs, and not to, and can also call in a scout plane, so very handy as well. Second off, we got some Tank Hunters Infantry Section to help you kill enemy light vehicles. You can easily upgrade them with Piets. So you might do some decent damage versus mediums as well. Um, if you want to go for it, there's that command attachment, the Valentine tank. Quite cheap. Um, acts a little bit like a medium, but doesn't pack the punch of a true medium. But if you can rush it out, it might do a lot of damage. For the artillery in this doctrine, we got the mortar cover. Which will rain down a mix of high explosive and white fossil shells. So, definitely not something you want to stand in because you'll burn alive. And last but not least, if you haven't been burned enough already, you can always call in the Firestorm Battle Group. It's the Crocodile Flamethrower Tank. Now, this is interesting. This is not the crocodile I remember. Maybe my mother found a different crocodile. <laughs> Let's just call it in to see.
So this one is actually cheaper than the crocodile in the game, if I'm not mistaken. In the live game. But it still works. And it's still a beautiful tank. So here it is, the crocodile. And it can shoot flames. Beautiful tank. Actually nice that it's a bit cheaper since it's not a heavy heavy. It's a heavy medium, but not really a heavy tank, so I don't mind this at all. So that's it for the 79th armor division. And for the last one, let's go to the, the Air Force Commander. Last one, of course, none other than the uh, Royal Air Force, the RDF. RDF, of course, can give you some support with a forward logistics glider who can deploy weapon teams, commandos, and act as a retreat point. Then, if you still need some more weapon teams, you can drop yourself some medical supplies, mortar, and a T gun for a bunch of manpower and some munitions. Oh, now the sneaky, the special boys from the Air Force, of course, the infiltration commandos can be deployed from some buildings or from off the map to support you as well. Also, they come a little a bit later CP than you might be used to, just to balance them out a little bit. Um, as an artillery strike, we've got the 9.75 inch flame mortar support. Hey, this is not the kind of flames that you get from the Soviets. Soviets, you're like, ah, it's a little hot. But we'll be alright, but if you stand in this one from the British, it's just a bit more than a little hot, it's scorching hot. You know, die very quickly if you don't get out of there, so it can be quite lethal if your opponent is unaware. And last but not least, this literally deletes everything. This is the full force of Britain's Royal Air Force. It's the Air Supremacy Operation. You'll get recon, you'll get attack planes, and after that, heavy bombers will absolutely obliterate everything in a certain particular area for whooping 250 munitions. So, lots of nice stuff in this commander. And now I'm curious to see what commanders are going to be used tomorrow. So, remember, ladies and gentlemen, uh, it is tomorrow. So tomorrow it is, yeah? Remember that. Team Commander, tomorrow and the day after tomorrow. Well, Alright, see you there. Bye bye. Okay, get some.